All right, so let's suppose that in fact the hurricane, Hurricane Dorian and the eyewall stays just offshore, but because it's so powerful and because it could be so close where miles matter, we're still looking at potentially a four to seven foot storm surge for Flagler and St. John's, maybe four to six in Duval and then points north all the way into Brunswick. So what does that mean? It doesn't necessarily mean folks that we focus on the ocean front. In fact, areas that extend from St. Augustine all the way down that are most sensitive to the storm surge are along the intercoastal. So come on in and again, not necessarily the beaches, but we're talking about uh, Davis Shores, downtown, down, so Davis Shores, downtown St. Augustine. We're talking about as we go up into Duval, we're talking about all these neighborhoods from Marsh Landing and the Sanctuary, uh, both sides of the intercoastal, Holiday Harbor, west side of the intercoastal, east side of the intercoastal, all of those neighborhoods, you folks know it, who uh, if you were here during Matthew, and then all the way up through Nassau County, Camden County, and then East even you folks in Brunswick on up through the sounds and then the Golden Isles that this is a surge that although it may not be and we don't forecast it to be devastating could still be significant to your neighborhoods.